been to Costco all my, has it been over a month? We went on a couple vacations. Uh, we're bare bones. Okay, I need to go grocery shopping. But I figured I'd pop inside and see all the new stuff that they have to offer. You guys know Costco is always rolling out all the new and exciting things. I actually follow a couple of Costco Instagram accounts and they're always showing. So I'm like, that's amazing. Also, I'm hoping that they have the pineapple bacon sausages because I've been craving them. Let's pop inside and see. I bet you there's some Halloween stuff. <laughs> If we're lucky. I thought I just saw a dog, but it may have just been a child. Anyway, here's what I'm talking about. Back to school snacks. If we see a dog, I'm gonna be really happy about it. Do you see that dude's hair? The yeah. most beautiful hair I've ever seen in my entire life. Okay, anyway, never, uh, I'm, something on my words, I'm already excited about something that I see. I've never seen these before. Wait, Cliff? I love Cliff. Love a good nut butter. Um, I know Avelina is allergic to everything except for peanut butter. Woo! And then I see peanut butter on here. That's awesome. Peanuts is what I meant to say. All right. That's great. Those are the nutrition facts. <laughs> what are these even? I love Cliff Bars. I feel like it's a uh, seven grams of plant protein. Not all the good stuff in here. I'm going to grab some. I think my kids are going to love that. They also love Z Bars. I guess it's time to stock up back to school snacks. This is the best price. I might even grab four boxes. Not four. Oh, wow. We're starting off with a bang. Okay. I might grab two boxes of these. This is the best price. I've ever seen they're on sale right now five dollars off okay I'm never gonna see that price again for the rest of my life so they're normally $21.79 for 36 bars and even that's a good price right but right now it's $16.79 for 36 bars and I call that a screaming deal that's not a deal that's a steal it's like they know it's back to school time <laughs> because uh these this is what I'm excited about I saw these Oh my gosh, I don't know, a month ago, but then I was at a different Costco and then I, I never, I don't think ever showed you. So I'm really excited to finally be able to show you. And not only are they here, they're also on sale. Normally $10.59 for 24 bags, you get nacho vibes and the vegan white cheddar. What I love about these hippies, if you are unaware of them, I used to buy them all the time, but not so much anymore because I have fallen off the healthy train. That's just my life, okay, on and off again. So this is vegan. It's also plant-based protein. It's got fiber. It's like a puffy chip and they're made out of peas, like uh, chickpeas. So, you know, it's a little bit more fiber, a little bit more protein than a typical chip. I mean, listen, it's still oil. It's still a chip-ish, but it's on the healthier side. So $7.99 for those. And I'm debating getting a second bag and watch me go. Oh wait, I didn't even get one yet. I don't know how I'm gonna fit anything else in my cart. I'm not sure if anyone's gonna buy that one, but I love how they put it out anyway. Uh, these are Cheez-Its. I feel like that's a good movie time snack. Also these gummy bears, these Black Forest gummy bears. When does the sale end? It's so small I can barely see. It might be over. It might be over like today. All right, sorry about that. I feel like it's like a flash sale. Whatever, gummy bears, 65 pouches. They also sell the Welch's, which is an even better deal, but it's like, I don't know, quality ingredients or something. Made good. All right, so I put these in the like movie snack concession area of our house and no one is gravitating toward them. I don't know what's wrong with them. I've tried both of them. I think they're fantastic. It's like a soft cookie. The Made Good brand is without is made without any of the major allergens. So this is $14 for, you get 16 of each. And I just think they're great. Like a Snickerdoo, oh my gosh, I couldn't. It, they're so good. And then of course, Famous Amos, if you're into that, 42 of them for $18.39. Ooh, but this sale ends on August 13th. So the sale is $14.69. And then some Oreos. Oh my gosh, okay, you get a two pack. And I feel like that's the perfect portion size if you're throwing it in a lunchbox or something. These are not on sale, $13.99, but you get a lot, 30 50 60. Ooh, what's over here? Are we getting our fall vibes on? This is a down blanket. Oh my gosh, I'm not ready for it. But also Wentworth is in need of a blanket. Ooh, I like this Berkshire. That's giving beautiful vibes. I'm not sure if I like the fabric of this. Down alternative. I don't know, you guys. It is, whoa, let me rethink that. It's $17, that's it, it's on sale. Normal price is $23 
and that's for a king. The queen size is normally 20, it's on sale for 15. Is this what Costco always talks about? Is this what Costco always talks about? Oh, my brain. <laughs> I think I got three hours of sleep last night. Three hours of like broken sleep, so it might not be a good day for talking for me. <laughs> These sheet sets. This is a king sheet set. Oh man, it's making me want some new sheets. A couple different prints here. Normally 20 bucks, it's on sale for 16. For a sheet set, we've got queen over here. Same prints for the queen, but the price is lower. $13, normally 17. Ooh, a micro cut. A paper shredder, $80, not on sale. Why are they putting non-sale items up here? I'm over it. Ooh, look, more snacks. They put a bunch of nuts right up in the front here. And I know some schools you can bring nuts and some schools you can't. Our kids are allowed unless there's a very severe allergy in the classroom. Like one year Wentworth couldn't and it was sad because he was really into pistachios that year. And, but obviously, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. Oh, you know what? One time I saw a meme or it was a reel on Instagram and it was talking about kids in college and getting all up in the peanut butter snacks, peanut butter, everything. And it was hilarious because you know, I think in most schools you can't pack uh, peanut butter, peanuts, because it's a major allergen. Anyway, I digress. $10 for this humongous, that's huge. My kids aren't really into those, I don't know, but it is a nice snack. Ooh, chicken breast, not on sale. Like why? I mean, I do need some and football season is coming up, so I guess I'll grab it. Ooh, tuna too. And these aren't on sale? Come on, Costco, this is, really great though it's the applesauce pouches get 24 in here for 11.89 and that is a screaming deal honey also not on sale but the best deal i've ever seen in my entire life like look at this a normal grocery store you get like that little bear for 16 dollars how long can we be a sad song Ooh, oat milk Ooh, italian sparkling mineral vasa okay you know what i did come for some garbage bags can someone please tell me why scented? Do you buy scented? I'm not into that. I just get the normal ones and call it a day. These are $17, not on sale. Ugh, my heart hurts. Since it's back to school, you know it's time for some sweater weather, even though it's 700 degrees outside. <gasps> These feel incredible. $15 for a scuba crew neck, like scuba Steve style, this color is gorgeous it's gorgeous <laughs> black lavender teal ooh leggings too purple all the fall colors and then we've got some more clothes over there it looks like men crew necks and pants and stuff ooh some joggers these are 13 dollars and they have pockets in them is this the new sectional that everyone's raving about okay it's 1150 dollars and it is with an ottoman it's a fabric sectional with a storage ottoman let's check out the storage capacity oh there it goes it's like a secret passageway in there all right cool this one i do believe is only a thousand this chair over here is a recliner. It's $439. Here are some deets on that. Is it furniture season here at Costco? I feel like we already went through that. $600 for a leather power recliner with power headrest. And then I guess they have a sofa. Oop, here it is, $1,200. Oh, can't wait for the next aisle. I swear every time I come, they are making chocolate chip cookies. Okay, $650 for this scream deal that's not a deal that's a s let's look inside i am looking for something for upstairs which one's gonna close first anyway this is an accent console it is beautiful it has birch veneers <laughs> i don't know what that means the dimensions and i'll have to remember this back again when i look i'm gonna go home and measure and see because this is beautiful i don't know if i want white actually but if you're looking for the dimensions it is 67.9 width 17.9 depth 33.2 height and this one over here is very reminiscent of the one that i have at home very reminiscent okay i was happy when this one came in back in stock and it's six hundred dollars the how big this is it makes a statement it's beautiful and it's really quality 
I cannot believe the price of this thing because it's 70 inches. It's a 70 inch console. So if you're looking for something, oh my gosh, look no further than the Costco. They have this side table too. They've had this for a while, $130. I seen this one as well. It's only $450. I say only like, oh, no big deal, $450. But it's a piece of furniture and it's large and in charge. It's a three in one TV console. It is much, oh, here it is in the flesh, is much lower to the ground than the other ones. I feel like the other ones are twice the height. But if you're looking for something like this, I love the wood tone. I wish it was taller because that's what I'm looking for. I'm being selfish. Oh my goodness, a table, a dining room table. I just redid mine, ha ha ha, $800. I spent more on mine. I think I like mine better though. <laughs> Even if I don't, I just have to say it because that's what I have. Okay, this one is $1,000. Whoa, I've always wanted a round table, but my house does not facilitate a round table. Love, oh my gosh, look at these. They're bar height stools. $1,000 for all these chairs and the table? Knock me over with a feather. Ooh, here's another sectional. It's a six piece modular fabric sectional with storage ottoman. Someone was trying on some shoes. It is $1,400. It's gorgeous. Feels really nice in quality. I think I came at like the perfect time of day. No one is here. Mark my calendar, okay? This rarely happens. $900 for this. I am kind of in the market for some dressers. This is, what do they call this? A drawer chest, mm, beauty. When my girls get their own rooms, like their dressers have seen the light of day. Okay, I bought them secondhand and when I got them, it was like barely hanging on. But these nightstands are $269.99 plus tax. Oh, and there's a matching headboard. This is $800 for the headboard and it's a king. Here's everything together. Do we like the, the matching stuff? I never grew up with matching stuff and I have a bedroom right now that's matching. Oh, does, the, does it have drawers? That's exciting. That would be nice. I am looking for a headboard, but I don't know. Ooh, hey, hey, hey. Speaking of headboards, over here we have some fake foliage. There's a fake magnolia tree, a faux magnolia tree, and then a faux, what is that, olive? Olive tree. This is six and a half foot, and the magnolia is 6.4 slightly smaller but you can't even tell the difference it comes in this beautiful pot oh beautiful i mean that's subjective but hey beauty's in the eye of the beholder and i say yes especially for the price 150 dollars for that top notch that's not a deal that's a steal thanks costco for making trendy stuff affordable <laughs> this three arm floor lamp nope not that this thing is $60 if you're in the market. You can't even see the floor lamp back there. You can only see the front. It's $200 if you're looking for a floor lamp with some shades on it. I've been eyeing these every time and I know I've made the macro friendly version, but they're on sale today and I feel like I just have to do it. Oh, I shouldn't do it. My stomach is like, no, please don't. But my heart is like, Kim, they might go out. Okay, they're on sale. <laughs> Ooh, wait, Trufu, my heart always wins. Okay, oh wait, they're covered in, what is that, white chocolate? Not my vibe. Trufu, blueberry and white cream chocolate. I love the Trufu stuff and I'm sure this is absolutely delicious. I'm gonna think on this and then circle back around. 10 bucks though for that amount, blowing my dang mind. Where's the strawberries? I need the freeze dried strawberries covered in chocolate. That's my jank. Oh my gosh, hold on, a skinny rice bar? I'm at the good Costco, by the way. Did I explain that? Or did you just gather that from the fact that I'm seeing a hundred new items? Skinny rice bar. Almonds and cranberry and almonds and blueberry. Galoosh. We're actually in the market for a new mattress. I had Lowell reach out. I've had Casper reach out at one point. I don't know what to do. And then what's that one that's going around? Starts with a B. I just heard someone talk about it. Birch, maybe? I don't know. Mattresses are so dang expensive. You know what mattress my mom <laughs> always grew up to raving about? Stearns and Foster. Do you guys have one? If you do, let me know. If you love it as much as my mom, probably not. Okay, here's a desk. This is a new one. You saw this one like elevates and stuff. That's 300. This is 380. It doesn't elevate, but it is an L shape. And here it is in the flesh. Wow must be mattress days here at Costco because they have a whole aisle of mattresses. We looked into getting a Stearns and Foster. It's like two grand. And then they have another one, a firmer one or something for like four grand. I can't even process. But apparently it's gonna last us forever. Hey, it's back to school. So we need new socks, except for these are all adult sizes. I need kids socks. Go still good prices on this stuff. Oh, someone changed their mind on the sweaters. Hey, they still have the Costco signature hat here. 
$17 for a two pack. I was so excited to show Alex and he was like, that's horrible. I don't like, what are you talking about? That's horrible. So I haven't worn it. I don't know. He's talking me out of it. Kirkland slides, even $13. These are amazing. I don't care what anyone says. Is today the day that I finally buy a blender that actually works because I haven't had a blender that works in probably my entire life. This is Vitamix. It's on sale right now. $80 off, normally $400. It's on sale for $320. All right, tell me about it. All you people with a Vitamix, tell me how much you love it. I can't do it. I can't spend that much money on a blender. Is this the one that blends rocks and stuff? Oh my gosh, Christmas ribbon. You know what though, I am happy to see, I don't see the Grim Reaper and I have been seeing that all around social media that, but I, I haven't been to the whole store yet. So let's hold on on that. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. <gasps> I'm craving for Christmas. I actually almost wore Christmas Little Debbie earrings. <laughs> I talked myself out of it, but I kind of regret my choice. All right, here are some glass mixing bowls. These look awesome and new. Eight piece Pyrex sculpted mixing bowl. $15 for eight piece. Oh my gosh, you guys. How am I gonna talk myself out of this? You know I've been in the hunt for bulls. I've been on the hunt, I've been in the hunt, I've been between the hunts. I need mixing bowls and these can easily transport. They have lit. I don't know if I can talk myself out of this. Oh my, okay. Here are some snack attacks. A three pack, three pack? Here it is, a little tester for us. It is a three pack. They've got Star Wars. They have Disney princesses. Those are so adorable. It has a little handle too. Be true, be kind, have courage. Great advice, words to live by. $20 for a three pack. I don't, is, is this gonna fit in a lunchbox or something or is it just to carry around the house? I mean, that's my kind of snack pack. I'll tell you what. Let's compare and contrast the blenders, shall we? There's a Ninja for only 80. Oh wait, is that a food processor? Yeah, it is. Okay, here's a Ninja Pro Blender. All right, Vitamix versus Ninja. Am I gonna spend $300 or am I gonna spend $70? Does that blend rocks? Probably not. Ew, but this crappy one over here, $70. It's a little mini one. I'm sure it has pros and cons. I don't even care. It's a two pack. E oh, two of them? Oh, shoot, you get two for 70 bucks. That's a screaming dude. That's not a deep. A cast iron skillet. I just bought one of these for my friend. I think it might be bigger than this, but honestly, I don't even, yeah, okay. Well, I think it is. <laughs> $20 though, great deal for a cast iron skillet. What, I haven't seen this before. Is this the kind of one? Yeah, double burner backsplash. This is the one that you put on a burner. If you've been in the market, it's on sale, $26.97. It's not on sale, but it does have the asterisk. This means it's not gonna be around for much longer. Have you seen these? I don't know where I've been. $18 and these Pyrex bowls. You know, like for this different seasons, they come out with different designs. This is Hello Kitty and then Disney. Super cute, I'm not a huge Disney fan, but a cute. All right, we've got some storage bins if you're looking to organize your life for back to school and all that kind of stuff. Ooh, they came back with these, these reusable storage bags. These are fantastic and a great deal. You get 14 pieces for $13. That's a steal. I almost wanna buy these, but I have so many of them at home. Um, I definitely use a lot of them for when, like packing lunches and stuff. So they have four snack bags, four sandwich bags, four half gallon, two gallon, and that's it. That equals to 14 and they're BPA free. And then they have these silicone bags. I don't know, I'd pick the other ones. Whoa, whoa, I gotta go back to school again. Wait, this is their whole back to school aisle? I might cry, I might actually cry. Hold on, what's up here? Ink? Where are the pens? All right, well, I have to ask around or I might have to go to my, my Costco has a whole aisle. Maybe that's the difference. Hey, these paper mate mechanical pens, listen at Target, this was like $15. At Costco, it's 12. Right now it's on sale for 10, for one, two, three, four, five, six. And I think at Target, it was even maybe just four. I can't remember, but I know that's a screaming deal. Good price. Scissors are on sale for seven and a half dollars. They've got notebooks. They have post-it notes, a ton of them. 1,000 sheets, is that what that says? Or 2,400 sheets for 13 bucks. Was hoping to get pens for back to school gifts for the teachers. I mean, obviously the gift is always a gift card, but I always like to throw something extra in there. Anyway, those are going out. Scream and deal, $10 for a two pack. What the heck? And it comes with a straw. 
All right, these are good too. And it has like that flip straw, always great. $19 for a two pack. That would be great for back to school. Um, I think it's a, an 18 ounce, 16 ounce. This one I have never seen, new to me, $20. You slide it to open. It doesn't come with a straw. Hmm. Hot for five hours, 14 hours cold. A couple different color options. I feel like they have to have more back to school supplies somewhere. Okay, this set I have yet to see. This is Darling. It's mango wood and enamel on the inside. Four pieces and it comes with a tray. It's $25. They still have this taco set too. I think it's just, a, it's a very, if, unless you have tacos very often, and I feel like we do have tacos very often, but I guess not enough for me to care about getting a set like this. It's $10. It does seem really fun, and I, I don't even warm up our tortillas. I'm the worst. Ooh, check this out. A Ray Dunn serving set. It's $13. Oh, these bowls are going out. I, they'll probably come out with some new prints. This is $12. I don't know how they sell these. Does anyone buy the water bottles that are not insulated? It doesn't, it doesn't keep your water cold. Do you just walk around drinking warm water? <laughs> $13, normally $19, so that's a really good deal. And then these are the special event quenchers. I only see USF. It's a local college to us. Um, and it comes with a straw, so that's scream deal. $45, though. Like, do they think these college kids are made of money or what? Hey, speaking of organizing your life before uh, tomorrow, here is a bamboo organizing box. It's a 10-piece set for $22, bucks, normally $30. If you've been waiting on this, time to strike. Oh, wow, I see this special event. I have no idea how much this is. Oh, yes, I do. It's right there. $60 for this Soho backpack. Ooh, it's so trendy. It's so cool. You, Ooh, Bagalani. I used to have one of these. And I, you know, I'm so ignorant. I don't know. And someone was like, oh, that's a pretty expensive bag. And I was like, I don't care. I think I got it at a thrift store. Anyway, short story long. They have them in a couple of different colors. $60 for a backpack. Cheaper than a diaper bag, honestly. And you can probably have it use it the same way $39 Ooh, see this one's cute over the shoulder I'm actually in the market for one of these I don't really use a purse oh and it comes with a little pouch worth it comes in a couple of different prints solid black and then black with a little firework oh my word okay I grabbed one of these I must have had it when I was postpartum with Meredith and Wolfgang. Wow, really, have I had it that long? I think this is the color I have. Actually, mine's more brown, but I like this taupey color. This is $16, and it's a ladies' cardigan, and this one is more of like a burnt orange. I love these colors. They even have like a heather gray and a solid black. I might get the black. You guys, this is such, it's so beautiful. It doesn't add a lot of bulk, but it's like the perfect weight if you live in Florida specifically and it's like the perfect length. I think it's just a wonderful little addition to your wardrobe. Oh my word, I'm all over the place. Uh, clothes, I guess, apparently. Adidas two-piece set, the kids sets. I need to look through the clothes because my kids, I tell you, I'm not sure if they can even wear these to their school because of the um, Adidas stripes. I'm gonna have to check on their dress code, but there's more Adidas stuff up there. All right, more two-piece sets over here. Ooh, I really like this. Ooh, it's like a little sweater. You guys, it's literally 425 degrees outside right now. I can't even think about wearing this, but oh my gosh, is it dark? Oh, I wish the pants matched. It's not as cute as I thought it would be, but that's $20. Oh, see, these pants match. You know, more than that one did, at least. So I really like it. I think it's cute. And then they have those prints over there. You saw them. They've got sweaters and they've got bathing suits. They don't know what the heck is going on. Well, you know what? No time like the present to go through the book section. I'm just going to give you an overview. Oh, look, Van Gogh. Oh, my gosh. Mer and what's her name? Aveline. Oh, Fancy Nancy. <gasps> she loves Fancy Nancy. I am really upping our Fancy Nancy book collection, and I think she would love this. I'm gonna get it. Monet! I almost got a Monet when I was printing out the pictures for our dining room. Oh my gosh, Bernstein Bears. The I Can Read 8 set. How much is this? Oh my gosh, $40? I'm not buying it if it's 40. It's even 16. I'm like, ugh, I can go to the thrift store and get this for like a dollar seventy-five. I could cry. Wentworth has a ton of books, so I'm gonna hold off on that. Most request hold on, let me tell you a story about Van Gogh. <laughs> <laughs> Short story long, guys. All right. Oh my gosh. Wait, Mark Twain over here. The Mark Twain collection. This is fantastic. $33. 
All right, all right. So anyway, about uh, Van Gogh over here, Avelina was making a cake. It was in her summer bucket list to make a cake, like decorate, what well, well, she called it something, a, a face cake, or I can't remember. Anyway, she decorated it to look like Ed Sheeran, but I posted on Instagram and it was like, that looks like Van Gogh. All right, cool story, tell me more. Such a fun age. What do we got? Chapter books over here. What do we got? One True Loves. What do we got? Get a Life, Chloe Brown. What do we got? The Marriage Portrait. What do we got? Too Late. What do we got? The Perfect Marriage. What do we got? Only Love Can Hurt Like This. Oh, isn't that a song? Only Love Can Hurt Like This. The Boys from Biloxi. I'm pretty sure I at one point lived in Biloxi. No, is that Arizona? Alabama. Where did I come from? Birmingham. It's not my fault I don't remember. Okay, I was like zero years old. $15 for this is, would make a great birthday gift, a great Christmas gift. Is it scary that I'm talking about Christmas? I'm sorry, it's in my blood. $15 for all that you get in here. Screaming deal. That's not it. Ooh, this is a screaming deal too, an activity pad. It's $12. <gasps> Halloween costumes. See, now Costco has no idea what's happening, okay? But I'm excited. To explore. Oh my gosh, look what I see in the distance. Do you see it? Did you see it? Mm hmm. It's here. It's here. Oh my heavens, these are so adorable. Have a nice day. Oh, I love that someone wrote that. Oh, that makes me so happy. It's Peppa Pig book. It is, I don't know. I don't know how much this is. If I had to guess, $10.79, it's not the sticker pad. But here, oh, this is like the bet. You know what? I'm glad they got these risers because before it's just so hard to look at books like that. Okay, anyway, I'm pretty sure this is what's $10.79. No, it's $11.99. Don't ask me anything. Uh, itsy Bitsy, we got Old McDonald. We got Five Monkeys. What do we got over here? The Wheels on the Bus. What do we got over here? Five Minute Little Mermaid Story. What do we got over here? Five Minute Princess Stories. What do we got? Five Minute Horse Stories. What do we got? Batman Stories. What do we got? Baby Animal Stories. What do we got? Paw Patrol. What do we got? Five Minute Cat in the Hat. What do we got? Coco Malone. What do we got? Princess Beginnings. Actually, this is amazing. Toy Story. I love Toy Story. $11. And look, all those toys are included. If you're having a Toy Story birthday party, like use those as the cake toppers and you have a gift. It's the perfect combo. Same with the Disney princesses. Oh my gosh. I don't want to think about birthdays. I don't want to think about birthday parties. I might just forego everyone's birthday this year and just write them a check <laughs> write them a check we can go to europe with as much money as i spend on all their birthday parties we might just do that i don't know have like a family memory birthday party wouldn't that be fun i feel like we did that a couple times when the kids were younger so we might do that again implement it this year last year would have been a better time to implement that i don't know what i'm doing 300 facts these books are really drawing my attention like look how cool this is minimal words that's what i'm all about when i'm reading a book these are all new to me. I haven't seen any of these before. Explore with me. Oh, so cute. And then we have tummy time, a book for tummy time. This is crazy sauce. Oh, that's actually really good. High contrast. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is the coolest. And you can touch it and it at like sensory-ish. Sleepy sleepover with someone. I don't know, sleepover with Susie. Oh, Susie, what are we doing? Popcorn? All right, I gotta get out of here. This is the other side of the bathing suits and then all those booty shorts. I feel like we've seen all of this before. The summer is ending, summer is over. I don't wanna talk about it anymore. I don't care about any of this. But check out the costumes. All right, what do we got over here? <laughs> I promise I'll try to stop saying that. We have Peacock Girl. Oh, look how cute. Oh, she doesn't have legs. Who has legs over here? Unicorn Girl. Oh, this is darling. So these costumes are $30. So in the realm of getting a costume, I feel like that's pretty affordable. Unless you get it secondhand, which is, is this a flamingo? I could cry. I could cry. Wait, it goes on her head? <laughs> That's really funny. I wonder if they have my size. Wouldn't that be great? Okay, anyway, we always go to Once Upon a Child. It's a consignment and thrift store for kids, local to me. I'm sure there's one by you too. They're all around. There's a mermaid. Oh my gosh, Elsa. 
the Frozen Queen herself. It's not really Elsa. It's like a knockoff version. It's like the Dollar Tree version of Elsa, except for it's $30. So I don't know what to say about that. But anyway, once upon a child, we stock up on costumes. This is like a high quality costume. It comes with all the pieces and swords and things. Let me get my words out. Once upon a child, we go there. We stock up on costumes. We have them for ever until our kids grow out of them. And it's so great. It's like $4 or less. Sometimes it's around four dollars, three and a half dollars, more than that for a costume, and you're like, wow, done. Except for I always do family costumes, and it's just extra costumes for them to have fun, and they always have a parade at their school, so I just let them do both. Because like, if you're paying three dollars and fifty cents for a costume, why not get more than one and let them have fun? And then they get to play dress up all year long and all that good stuff. So Spider Man over here, oh, is that a witch? Gosh, you guys know how I feel about witches. I love them. <gasps> Can we get it in my size? Okay, this is getting me really hyped for fall, for Halloween. Oh my gosh, I have goosebumps. I remember when I was in labor last year, I was making Halloween cauldron brownies, okay? And it was the best time of my life. It was the highlight of my year, year last year. And then I gave birth and everything went downhill. <laughs> I've not been okay ever since, but you know what? I'm slowly coming back to life. So I feel like this Halloween is gonna be it for me. Well, check out this. This is like high quality space astronaut type of stuff. We have special forces happening over here. This is fantastic. It comes with a compass. <gasps> I wonder if it actually works. It does not. <laughs> more snacks. Oh my gosh, I feel like I've been filming for two hours. <gasps> more snacks. Wait, where's the Grim Reaper? I swear I saw him. Oh, there he is over there. All right, let's get to these snacks first. We got snack trade. Wait, what is happening? Pokemon trading cards? Trick or trade trading card game. Wait, do people still do the Pokemon swaps? Wentworth has a few Pokemon cards and he does it with like one of his friends. That's really cute, but $35? Oh my gosh, I could cry. But it's a 120 pack. Okay, that's actually pretty cool. I wonder if I get this for him, if it would be a good reading incentive for him. Because, you know, sometimes kids and they're like, eh. so that might be a good incentive. But also $35, I'm like, eh. ooh, speaking of eh, Legos, does anyone actually have luck with keeping their Legos organized? Okay, this whole thing is $90 or this one. Lego Dreams Treehouse or City Submarine. I guess one or the other, 90 bucks. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's the smell of chocolate chip cookies in the air. I don't know if it's looking at that Reese's. I don't know what the heck this thing is. Oh my gosh, Tabasco sauce. Avelina would literally cry if she saw this. Should I get it for her for Christmas and hide it away in my bedroom? <gasps> Fruit Loops? What are these? Things eating cereal? Eleanor would probably cry for that one. Oh my gosh, a Reese's? I could cry. I've never wanted a stuffed animal so much in my entire life. What's the pink one have down here? She's got a push pop. That is a bundle of joy right here. I don't know how much these pieces of crap are. Zuru Smackies. Snackles? <laughs> oh my goodness, there's a chocolate bear. Oh my gosh, he's eating a Hershey's chocolate bar. We have to dig. What else can we find? A lollipop? <laughs> An elephant? Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Okay, I think we saw them all. <laughs> Have yet to look at the clothes. The Funhouse treats. The best Halloween candy. No one comes to our house for Halloween. I guess no one wants to walk down the driveway. <laughs> I don't know. $17.99 for, it's probably like 500 pieces of candy in there. It's a screaming deal. They're not that big because it's like, you know, little, little chokeables and stuff. This one, I feel like this is my go-to. Should I grab a bag early Halloween? I always grab a bag for the house and a bag to give away. But we're not giving any away and I usually buy Play-Doh, so I don't know what I'm talking about. This is $20. Maybe I can stuff some in teacher gifts. I'm just using that as an excuse to just eat it. All right, and then we have Kit Kats. Ooh, churro flavor, never saw that before. This is $16 and you get 100 pieces, white cream, milk, chocolate, but the churros. All right, here's what we came for. I've, I've been hearing him go off. I think, well, maybe I, oh, there, there he goes. Oh, look at his eyeballs. Oh. I have no idea what he said. I'll be coming for you soon enough. I understood that part. All right, how much is this piece of crap? I actually think this is amazing. 
Take my soul? I don't know, man. Want to switch? Okay. It says it's only 10 foot. Um, pretty sure that's inaccurate. It's $250. Oh, he said save the last dance from me. All right. He's pretty cool. He's pretty cute. Woohoo! Here this is again. Disney Halloween Village 12 piece set is $100. I'm hyped about this one. A pumpkin greeter, $54.99. Do you hear him? Oh, he doesn't move, but he does sing a little song, a mariachi song. Ooh, a sample. Thank you so much. Ooh, it's my favorite day. All right, a free sample. First one of the season. Not sure if it's back to school season or fall. They have some welcome mats here. Four different prints. Oh, just kidding. There's more down here. Hello fall. Hey there, pumpkin. Those are really cute. Outdoor mats were 10 and then the accent rug, I guess, is 20. And then they have some pillows. Happy to see these on sale. Not sure if I'm going to have room in my cart, but I threw one in there anyway. It's a 30 pack. Normally it's 20 bucks, but it's on sale for 15 right now. And that's a stupendous screaming deal. Lemon, lime, grapefruit. These are one of the only ones, if not the only sparkling waters that don't have natural flavors in them. They are flavored with the fruit. I'm trying to look for a nutrition label. I bet it's on the bottom, but it's only flavored with like lemon or lime or grapefruit. Do you catch my drift? And then over here, they have the lemonade sparkling water. So I might grab some of these. Oh my gosh, they're on sale too. For $11, normally $14.69, 24 cans in here. Maybe I can get to this nutrition label. Okay, this one has a little bit more ingredients. It is colored with hibiscus. Pretty cool. I am traveling backwards through Costco. I'm all kinds of messed up, okay? I don't know where to go. Fiddle farting around over here. <gasps> Mango jalapeno, no. Where's the sausage? The most fun aisle at Costco is the electrical aisle. I don't remember what we need, but I do remember Alex asked me and I said, oh, I don't normally go down that aisle, but I will, oh, light bulbs. Ha 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 ha, sparked it. I'm in the bread section. This is one of the reasons why I love this Costco so much. They have the seeded Dave's Killer bread, the white Dave's Killer bread, and then raisin the roof. <laughs> I've never seen this one at Costco. It smells so good. $8.50. No pumpkin pie yet, sad to report. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Actually, now that I say it, I kind of smell it. I might just be willing it into existence. Okay, cream cheese. I don't even like pumpkin pie. It just reminds me of the season. These danishes, they have apple filled danish. They have cream cheese. This is my all time favorite. The almond filled danish. You get two four packs for $12 and you'll gain 12 pounds eating all of them. I know from experience, okay? Hey, Costco's branching out on their cookie game. I've never been a huge fan of these cookies, these in particular. I feel like they're not great. I don't know, maybe I just don't like cookies. I just like the dough. But $10 and they have some more cookies. Check it out. You want some more? Whipping out the golden kiwis for Costco. They are $10. I don't know why. I much prefer the green. I, I like the tartness. They've got that saxophone music playing in the bakery for the workers. And you know what? It reminds me of nap time in kindergarten. I'm here for it. I feel like this is what I'm smelling, the like pumpkin pie scents. This is coffee cake. Oh my gosh, someone tear me away. Coffee cake muffins. How much is this piece of bread? $10 for 12, two packs. So you can get coffee cake. You can get vanilla chocolate chunk. You can get chocolate chocolate. You can get corn muffins, blueberry. Are you joke for $10? Also peek on these cakes. All right, I've been grocery shopping a little bit. Back to the fun stuff. These are new to me, blueberry pie rolls. Who loves blueberry pie? I feel like apple was an after sight. <gasps> How about pecan pie rolls? Oh, I'd be all over that, $12. They need to make pecan pie rolls. I don't think I've seen these at my Costco either, the firm tofu. There are four 18 ounce packs and it's $7.50. Once it's done, hang the sign. Ooh, that's it. Once they're done, they're gonna hang the sign. Close up, wait, what time is it? Are they closing soon? Okay, I gotta get going. What is this, stuffed salmon? Never seen this before, that looks fantastic. What is that, a fruit tray for $18, wow. That's not a deal. Fruit and cheese, all right, this is what, chicken kebabs, never saw those at my Costco either. How much per pound, $8 a pound. Already skewed about chicken salad, 
We've got the uh, quesadilla. Deal. What's for dinner tonight? Oh my gosh, I have to make dinner when I get home. Okay, good news, I found the chicken sausage. Bad news, they only have chicken apple. Should I still get it? I feel like I'm so spoiled. The one time I had pineapple bacon. Just got another sample, Country Time Lemonade. It comes in a pouch these days. The sugar content is above and beyond. This is another sample. Do any, of, any one of you remember those like squeeze bottles, like squeeze juice bottles? Those probably Kool-Aid or whatever. I remember having those for school lunches. All right, bon appetit. I don't know what the heck kind of salsa she put on that, but it was the most delicious thing I've ever had in my entire life. Kickin' feta dip. That looks really good, $7.50. Hold on, they have pineapple. Oh my gosh, I hated this. Pineapple jalapeno, did not like it. Spinach artichoke dip. We are hosting um, one of our family members' birthday parties, so I might grab that. They also have chickpea and wheat berry pasta salad. Wow, that looks gross. I'm just kidding, it looks great. Fried pickle and ranch dip. I wonder if it was this that she was piling on top. Oh my gosh, no more Frank's Red or whatever it was called. Is this what she had? Well, time for salsa, that's all I can say. Here it is, Jack's Organic. I wonder, I'm gonna go back and see what she was piling. So we can't do a lot of fragrance. We've got too many people with sensitive skin in our house, but this smells delightful. Ocean Mist, and it's on sale until God knows when. $18 normal price, it's on sale for $14.39. They've got the Scrub Daddy 8-pack, $16.49. I wish they were mommies. Barbecue season is coming to an end, but Costco is clearly confused about basically everything. They have this 200 count fancy fruits party pack, $18.59, comes with 50 of each, 50, 50, 50, 50. If you ask me, the napkins are unnecessary. It is so dead here. I'm sincerely worried that they're like about to close, but it's only four, so I don't know, man. Uh, Chobani Vanilla Greek Yogurt Tropical Fruit. I've never seen this one before. That sounds pretty cool, but it's 12 for $11, so not the best price, but I guess if you're getting something, you know, specific like that. I just checked, it's 14 grams of added sugar. I, I couldn't do it. I could not do it. I got the zero. Do you ever take samples sometimes because you're a people pleaser? Why did I, Why am I the way that I am? Oh, it's an ice cube. I thought it was like a chunk of fruit. All right, bottoms up. It was actually delicious. It was actually great. Mango nectar. If you are looking for a great end of summer dessert, this is $22.79 for the Cheesecake Factory Classic Selection. How many do we get in there? I don't know, three pounds. Oh, I haven't seen these before. Mexico con crema, strawberry fiesta, mango, and coconut. I feel like my kids would love these, but I have too much walking around to do. I feel like they're gonna melt before I get home. But these are $14 and you get 30. And then over here, they have the mini tubs, frozen yogurt. Ooh, I should get some of these. $15 for 18 tubs. Whoa, it's a lot. 10 grams of added sugar. Hmm, I feel like we could do better than that. These are the bars. Oh, golly goodness. These have 15 grams of added sugar. Uh, the um, One of them has 11, the mango. What in the world? Added sugar, you guys, not from the fruit. I get the ones, oh, see, outshine, hold up. These outshine bars, $9 and you get 24 bars. Let's check on, oh my gosh, send me home. 24 grams of added sugar. I could cry. They, I think this is the brand that has the no sugar added also. Obviously that's not it. I obviously know it's ice cream, but I also get the fruit bars that have like no added sugar. I don't know, and my kids enjoy them just as well. These pancakes, these are new. 64 pancakes, it's the family pack. There are four in each pouch and it's $13. Great for back to school, great for your like, oh my gosh, what's for breakfast guys? Scrounge around and uh, no chocolate muffins. That's sad to report, that's a sad day. But they do have the blueberry oat muffins, um, or if you wanted to make your own pancakes, but if you don't have time to do that, buy them, you know? Convenience, sometimes convenience wins, and that's okay. Ooh, chicken melts, my kids adore these. Honestly, they should have had that Reaper sing, Look What You Made Me Boot Do by T-Swift. 36 count of these Rice Crisps are $16.89, great for back to school. Oh, these are the Welches. Well, I thought they were Welches. Turns out they're moths. And these are on sale, $11.49, uh, but they're on sale for $8.89. Pretty sure there's a sample for these, but she's still trying to get them out. Chicken meatballs, 
How much do we get in here? 2.5 pounds, naturally cooked. I'm gonna try that out. So they're not the chicken meatballs, but I'm gonna tell you what, the samples today are crazy. I'm not gonna need dinner when I get home. The kids can just fend for themselves. The keto, no sugar added granola, blueberry cinnamon, it's great. Catalina Crunch, amazing. $11 for that. It tastes like cinnamon toast crunch, it's awesome. And then they also have this sunflower cereal, seven sundaes with real cocoa powder. So like cocoa pebbles, but healthier, $10.79. I don't often see new seasonings other than the Kinder's Buttery Steakhouse. Oh my gosh, all the Kinder's when those came out, it was like heaven. This is a smoky honey habanero sweet and spicy blend. It's 12 bucks. And then all the Kinder's, you guys, this is like the king of seasonings, wood fire garlic. The blend is great. This is king though. If you could be a king of all the kings, I don't know what that would be called, but it would be, you know what it would be called? Buttery Steakhouse. That's the best. I feel like Eleanor might like these. Ooh, someone made a choice right here. Edamame beans, high protein super snack. Are they crispy? Ooh, they are crispy. It's like a freeze dried edamame. Low carb, vegan, all the good stuff. Okay, a little bit of iron in here. I'll give these a whirl for $7.89. Here are the mama chias. It's chia seed, fruit and fruit and veggies. Whoa, the heck? Blackberry bliss is what's in this. A bunch of omega-3s, prebiotic, fiber, 70 calories for $10.59, you get 12. We all know and love the pretzel crisps, the original, the OG, the fantastic, nine bucks. Guys, did you know they had honey mustard flavor? $6.79, less. I don't know if they're any good, but if you like honey mustard, I bet they are. It's the end of summer blowout. I bought these in the beginning of summer and left them at someone's house, and I've been crying ever since. Spicy, I should get four bags of this, but then I'll eat four bags and it's just not a good situation. These are the best chips I've ever had in my entire life. I feel like the bag is somehow smaller than it used to be. Probiotic strawberry yogis. My kids love these, so of course I'm getting another pack for uh, end of summer, back to school, movie nights. Oh my gosh, what the heck are these? It's fun packaging and a spritzel cookie bite. Birthday cake shortbread. Like who wouldn't want that for nine bucks? Oh my gosh. I want to get them, but like my thighs. Speaking of my thighs, Heavenly Hunks are on sale right now. And I don't think I can say no. $8, normally 10, so you're saving two bucks. My kids love them. It's for the kids. <laughs> okay, we meet again. Let's check on the 15 grams of added sugar. I mean, I don't eat ice cream, so. I'm gonna leave them, but I'm sad about it. <laughs> but they do have the Unreal bars, dark chocolate and coconut minis, which are is like the second best thing. Ten eighty nine for these, and check on the added sugar, three grams. That's it. I don't need them, but like I want them. This is new to me. They have the Kilimanjaro chocolate nuts and cranberries trail mix. Oh my gosh, it looks so fancy. This is eleven dollars and seventy nine cents. That that's actually looks amazing. And Meredith loves nuts, like the trail mix nuts. Uh, if I get her the trail mix with the M&Ms, she'll only eat the M&Ms. <laughs> but if I get her the ones with like, anyway, it's a mixture, but these are fantastic. The JoJo's dark chocolate bars, these are actually on sale for $8, normally 11. Well, I think I'm gonna give these a try. I normally get the Kirkland brand granola bars and I'm still gonna do that. They have a lot of different variations of granola bars that are offered. I've never seen the Kodiak brand. They're protein packed granola bars. It makes sense for them to do this, okay? These are $13 for a 20 count. You get chocolate chip and s'mores. And check out over here, they've got the chomps. What's zero sugar and then zero sugar? What's the difference between grass-fed and finished beef? This is grass-fed and finished beef. Oh, jalapeno. Ooh, that's fun. $17 for each of them, 12 sticks, but they're huge. I'm trying to find anything new in the like self-care aisles over here. Hygiene. This is not new, but it's $4.97 and you get two hairbrushes. That alone is worth it. And then the hair clips too. So if you're in need of a hairbrush, cool. I'm going to go through the clothing just for a couple of minutes until I'm going to check out um, ooh, a tie front. Is that coming back? This is $10, normally $13. They've got a bunch of different colors. 
Okay, youth stuff. That's what I'm more interested in right now. They have a youth short, Pumas, all day comfort for $15. They also have um, like sweatpants shorts. Oh, and then the dry fit shorts. Oh my gosh, these are $12 for Nike. And I'm gonna try to find the right size. I don't, they don't even have sizes on them. How do I read this thing? Is this a size six? Looks like it. It has a huge Nike check on it, and I just don't know if that's school appropriate, so I'm gonna hold off on that, but it's a great deal. Also, the Nike Just Do It shirts. Over here, we've got Chicago Bulls. Oh no, it's Spider-Man. We gotta go over here. The Rams? No, that's Batman. $20 for a fleece. Oh my gosh, it's Barbie. Inspire the world. And I just have one question. Where is my size? <laughs> it's adorable. Oh my gosh, and it comes with a shirt. It's a three-piece set for $20. You wanna check on the Batman? What's happening there? Oh, boring. Actually, I love Batman. He is my favorite superhero. Okay, they, I just, I guess I have another question. What's happening here? <laughs> um, I don't know what this is, a dress. Okay, that's interesting, a gauze dress. $18 for that, they've got some shorts. These feel pretty nice. Flutter sleeve top over here. Ooh, ah, fashion, eight bucks. Here's my cart too. I just kind of dumped it because pushing it is too much. Okay, I just decluttered Wentworth's closet today. Uh, so I kind of know what he likes and what he doesn't. He wouldn't like those, but uh, $13.50 for those, great deal. Oh my gosh, those are still bathing suits. This is a two pack of tees for $13.50. What's happening over here? We've got, oh, a pajama set, yes. They're the Capris, pew, 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 sound the alarm. Oh my gosh, it's a four piece set. What, $16. I don't need pajamas, but if I did, oh my gosh. I mean, do I need pajamas? <laughs> Is it a four piece set? I think I love them. They're $4 off, what do you think? Okay, well, I think I love it, but I'm gonna keep it here. They've got gray, they've got coral, and they've got blue. Oh my gosh, wait, more over here. I think I love these even more. Look at these, it's like a capri jumper, jogger kind of thing, not a jumper, just a jogger. This is a three piece set, love this just as well. The polka dots, this is $19 and they've got dark blue. Oh wait, and then they have this, this is a three piece set for $15. Love this, ooh, I love that too. I like a good capri, even the jogger I'll take. All right, where are the kids clothes? What are, what's happening here? This is ladies lightweight joggers. I feel like we saw these up front. They're just repeating themselves, okay? Ooh, these are really nice shorts, really comfortable. These are like the biker shorts for 13 bucks, a screaming deal there. Men's clothing, I feel like, nah, nothing ever too exciting over there as I look at black leggings. All right, what do we have over here? We've got some jeans, we've got some capris, got some shirts happening. What are these? I don't know, they feel pretty nice. I'm really looking for kids clothes. What happened? I think maybe the ladies is in the middle. Wait, room service, two piece pajama set. Love, this is $17. Come, oh, these are pants. Oh my gosh, this is a four piece set for $13. Oh, someone take me away from this place, okay? I'm just gonna spend money. I don't need any of this. You saw my closet clean out. I don't need anything, but do I want it? Heck yeah, this is all clearance right here. Oh, this is a nice shirt. I just hope no one takes my cart. Okay, we've got bathing suits, boring. What's over here? A lot of different things. If you can see the prices up there, you can guess how much anything is because it's too much reading for me. We've got Mickey Mouse, we've got Timberland, we've got a shark maybe. Was that a monster? We've got a lot happening actually. Oh my gosh, this is so adorable. Not school appropriate, but adorable. Also, someone tell me why girls' shorts are always like this big. Oh my heavens, all right. Here it is, a shacket happening. First one of the season, $15 for a shacket. Is that still in? I assume it is. Look, remember that dress we saw? It's the same material, but in a shirt. Oh my gosh, did someone take my cart? I will cry. Nope, still there. Ooh, did I show you these puffy jackets? This is an Eddie Bauer jacket, $20 for this is a screaming deal. That's a steal. Different colors, different sizes. I love that. And then they have, I guess, another color over here, a blue and then Adidas sweaters over here. Oh, Adidas, I feel like I showed you this. 
Oh my gosh, but did I show you the other jacket patterns and colors collection? Costco is really like killing it with the PJs, okay? They know my sweet spot. They have like 20 aisles of, or piles of just pajamas. All right, here's half my stuff. I'll come back tomorrow for the rest of it. All right, that was it. Thank you guys so much for watching and shopping around with me. Hope you enjoyed seeing all the new stuff that Costco had for end of summer, back to school, fall-ish. I'm surprised I didn't see more back to school items. I was really just hoping for like a pack of pens or a pack of Sharpies or a pack of something to fill in the teacher gifts. I did grab some chocolate, so I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, I'll see you next time. Bye.